Good morning, you guys. Today is Saturday. We are headed out for a thrift trip. I was supposed to go get my hair done this morning, which is why my hair is looking like this, but um, it was rescheduled for tomorrow. So why not use that extra time that we have to go thrifting? So come along and let's see what we can find. All right, you guys, so you can see it's um, kind of an overcast day. It's supposed to rain today, but we are here at the thrift store. I actually do have some things I'm looking for. Um, I don't have any white collar button down shirts if you can believe that so um have that on the list and then just some other spring summer essentials so let's take a look Okay guys, not much luck finding what I came in here looking for, but I have found some, you know, a few good other pieces that will be nice during spring, summer. Oh, look at this. Look at this y'all, this is our old Greyhound bus driver jacket. They never wore it. I think I was crazy if I said I wanted this because I do, but I'm not going to get it. Alright you guys, this is another section I like to look at. It's the graphic tees. They always have something nice over here.
he won't eat for real. <laughs> I think I'm a good one. Right, you guys that was a pretty successful trip yeah guess what i found can you see that i found a chanel j12 watch thrifting y'all i saw this watch when i was in the bahamas in 2020 and i sent it to my husband and he was like girl five thousand dollars we not buying that and i said a oh, long time ago in another video that this was a watch that i had wanted and look what I found today. Y'all, this watch is so heavy. And look how much I paid for it. $15. The only thing is, it is too small for my wrist. So I am going to have some links put in. When I get home, I'll show you all what I got. And maybe do a try on haul. All right, you guys. I am here at Upscale Cheapskate. And see what items they want to buy. I am done with upscale cheapskate as you can see it is now raining um out of all those items y'all they only took two items um you know I guess that's okay because it's two less than what I brought in and it was in my opinion the two least desirable items it was a pair of black jeans and a pair of um jogger sweatpants that I bought from Nordstrom so um Plato's told me that this store was geared more towards a more mature demographic. That is not true because all of the young ladies working in there look like they're between the age ages of 18 to 25. Um, and then looking around in the clothes in there, it's a lot of fast fashion brands like um, Shein, Boohoo. I saw a lot of misguided, a lot of fat, um, Forever 21. As a matter of fact, a pair of the camo pants that I bought were from, not Forever 21, um fashion nova a pair of camel pants that i bought are from fashion nova and it still had the tags attached so i'm at a crossroads either i'm going to donate the stuff either i'm going to give it away or i'm going to do mystery boxes on poshmark and i'm leaning leaning towards the more giving it away because i don't really have the time nor the desire nor the energy to put together poshmark mystery boxes and then you know ship them off so you know, it is what it is. The goal was just to get rid of the stuff and that's what I'm going to do. So um, it's gonna sit in my trunk <clears throat> until it's ready to be moved to its next home. And um, that's gonna be it, but I'm a little hungry, you guys. I um, have not eaten since about eight o'clock this morning. And um, so I'm gonna grab me something to eat on the way home and then I'm gonna call it a day i may go back out and get my nails done i don't know but we'll see all right you guys i am back from the thrift store i've had a chance to sit down and eat my lunch because your girl was hungry okay so let's go ahead and jump into this thrift haul so i can show you what i got all right the first item is this denim dress 
the material on it is very light so i don't even want to say this is really denim i'm just going to say it's like a denim wash but it, it's not jean at all because it's very very light um it's collared it's by a brand called fashion to figure i think that's a plus size line i'm not really sure but um it was 12.99 and by the way red green white and blue were all 50% off. Yellow was full price. So this dress was $12.99. It does come probably about a little bit past my knees. And it has like a little flare. You can kind of see it right there. Um, I don't, it says a size two. I don't know what a size two equates to in terms of this brand, Fashion to Figure, but um I tried it on and it fits me, so I'm going to guess their size too is maybe equivalent to like a 12, 14, because you know, some of these designers consider a size 12 plus size, but we ain't on that right now. So whatever the case may be, it does fit. I do like the fit. I'm going to wear this with my um, Dolce, uh, Dolce & Gabbana Barocco heels that I bought. You all would have saw those in my What I Bought This Month March edition. If you haven't seen that video, go ahead and check it out. But again, this is a dress that I purchased today, $12.99 from the thrift store. Another item that I bought today are these, um, I guess you can call it a splatter paint jogger. And these are extremely, extreme, extremely lightweight. It's kind of like a windbreaker material. It's by a brand called Love J and it still had the tag attached. It is a size large. Um, I know y'all probably looking at this like, girl, what in the world? But stay with me. I got because I got a whole vision for these. But these were $9.99. Again, yellow was um not on sale. But I really, really like these. And these are um very much summer and spring appropriate. Like this material is so so light. So it's not something that you'll get hot in. But um, I'm going to show you what I want to pair it with, with the next item that I bought from the thrift store. All right, so this next item that I purchased is this bodysuit. Y'all, look at this. So cute, so sexy, right? It still had the um, original tag attached. And looking at it, the tag on this bodysuit is the same tag that's on these pants. So maybe it was a, maybe it was a set and... I, I don't know, but I saw this. I picked this up first, and then I saw those pants second. I was like, ooh, those two would go so cute together. This bodysuit was $7.99, but I like this bodysuit because <clears throat> it is, you know, it, it has some sex appeal about it, but it still, you know, it still has some modesty to it with the um, how this part of it is covered. It does tie in the back. And y'all, this will be really, really cute under a blazer um, with a pair of jeans, just anything. You can really class this up. And I plan to wear it with these, with these pants. The lighting is not that great, but I plan to wear it, wear these two together with a pair of black um, strappy heels that I have. But I'm really pleased with this purchase. Again, it was $7.99 from the thrift store. The next item that I purchased is this blue eyelet uh, shirt. Now, this shirt, I was actually, um, Express has a shirt very, very similar to it in white, and I could never find it, uh, catch it in my size at Express, so I just kind of gave up on it, but I always liked the detail of the shirt. And again, it's an eyelet shirt. It has a like a mock neck type collar. It kind of flares, but not really. Um, I'm probably gonna tuck it in to some to whatever I wear this with. Oh, this is by the brand. Um, <clears throat> this is by the brand Banana Republic, and it was $7.99. As you can see, they ain't have a whole lot of nothing mod down today, but that's all right. The next item I purchased is just a graphic tee. It's this Mickey Mouse graphic tee. It was $3.99, and the thrift store in the men's section. You can find some of the best graphic tees there. I saw this one. I do like Mickey Mouse, <clears throat> $3.99. And you know, this would be perfect to wear on a Saturday when you're just going out running errands, you know, walk around the house in. I sleep in t-shirts. 
sometimes. Um, so this is a good all-purpose t-shirt. And um, again, $3.99 from the thrift store. The next item I purchased is this St. John belt. And this is a suede belt. This belt was $5.99. And you all know St. John is a brand that has been around for a long time. Um, their clothes are quite pricey. Sometimes I can find them in a the thrift store and sometimes I can't. It's not really my, my juge as far as clothes are concerned because it's a bit more, a lot more on the modest, more modest side. This, this again, this belt is by St. John. It was $5.99. It's just this tan suede from the thrift store. All right, the next item I purchased are a pair of loafers. You guys know that loafers is one of my favorite style of shoes. I know I'm a, I wear, you see me in heels all the time, but I really do like a good loafer. I saw these, these were new, never worn. This is by a brand called, um, looks like it says Her Style looks like it these were marked $7.99 but blue was half off so I got these for four dollars these um you know brand new never worn and I like the um trendy take on the loafer with the pointed heel as opposed to the more rounded square light heel so this does give it a more modern look I like the thick black sole um kind of reminds me of a um Franco Sarto loafer that i thrifted in goodwill one time and the girl did not put both shoes in the bag and when i went back to get it and the other shoe was nowhere to be found i was so mad because that franco sarto shoe was about a hundred dollars retail and they had it for 4.99 i was mad y'all but anyway so this kind of reminds me of that franco sarto shoe that um i thrifted before i do like the classic chocolate brown on it and I like how it has that, you know, that little way you used to put your penny at back in the day. This is a great modern take on a classic loafer. Again, these were $7.99. They were half off, so I got them for $8, I mean, uh, for $4. And they were brand new from the thrift store. All right, the next item that I purchased are these jeans. Now, this is by a brand called Soft Surrounding. And this is in a size, it says XL. This is in a size that says XL. The thing that, that attracted me to these jeans is the fact that there was no, there's no, um, there are no belt hoops on it. So I kind of like that. It has a built-in tummy control. Um, so I like that as well. And they're long and they have a split on the side. And, you know, I just like them. Now, you know what? Now that I'm looking at these, I'm like, are these maternity pants? Wait a minute. Wait, wait a minute. I might need to look this up. Soft surroundings. I'm a, hold on one second. Okay. Okay, so they're not maternity jeans. Because I was looking at these, I was like, hmm. The jeans on their website range between about $55 and $90. So, you know, I guess, I mean, I, I consider that a pricey pair of jeans. I don't know about you, child, but anyway, I can see myself wearing these with a pair of uh, platforms that I have, I've had for years, but these were $12.99 and got these from the thrift store. All right, the next item that I have is also another pair of jeans. And before y'all judge me, I know y'all saying, didn't you just get rid of a whole bunch of jeans? I did, but I wanted to um, find a pair of jeans in the thrift store. I like those, I think they're called Mason Margiela jeans. Um, I, they have the hem, the, the, the split hem right here at the waist. And I, I, I've been looking at those jeans for a while, but those jeans are expensive and I ain't trying to spend that kind of money. Um, so I wanted to find me a pair of jeans in a thrift store that I could just kind of DIY. And I found these. These were only $3.99. They're Levi. They're at the 515 boot cut. And the Mesa Margiela jeans, I believe, are a more straighter leg jean. But this one, you know, it's, it's, it's okay. It's like a slight boot cut. 
So what I'm gonna do is just right here, I'm gonna cut the jean to give it that um, slit in the side, like the Mesa Margiela jean. So once I DIY these, if they come out right, I'll show them to you, but $3.99 from the thrift store. The next item that I purchased from the thrift store is this 100% silk short set. It is um, by a brand called Options. And I really do like this. It's, you know, it's a little thin, but um, I, I'm, I, I really like it because the shorts actually look like a skirt, but you know, they're shorts. It was $5.99 for the set. And like I said, it is 100% silk. Here's the top that goes with it. Now, I have a pair of yellow shoes in my um, closet that I'm probably going to pair with these. I really like this. I mean, some of y'all might be like, girl, that is so ugly. And you you know, it, it is a little bit. However, you know, what I had to learn is not to judge things by how they look on the hanger, but you judge it by what it looks like after you put it on and style it because sometimes it could look totally different. How many of y'all have seen something online on the model and you like that is so ugly but then you see somebody else with it on and you're like dang that is really cute so i bought this 5.99 and once i do um style this i will definitely show it to you but yeah this two-piece short set from the thrift store all right you guys on to um thrifting at upscale cheeks at upscale cheapskate um which is also I consider it thrifting because it's secondhand. Um, I bought these orange strappy sandals. Now these are Fashion Nova by, um, these are by Forever 21. And I was just saying yesterday that I wanted me some orange strappy sandals. And lo and behold, I go into Upscale Cheapskate and I find them. These are in good condition, you know, hardly ever worn. And like I said, from Forever 21, I got these for $9.99. And I did try these on. They do fit very nicely. Um, it is not an 18-hour shoe. So whenever I wear these shoes, I'm, I'm, you know, you ain't gonna be able to wear them long or walk far because, honey, unless I put like a cushion or something right there. But they do overall look very cute on my feet. So I was happy to find these, especially after I had just said I wanted some orange ones for the low, low price of $9.99 from Upscale Cheapskate. All right, another item I bought from Upscale Cheapskate are another pair of jeans. Now these were $14.99, but they marked $14.99, but they were half off. So I paid um, $7.50 for I paid $7.50 for these jeans. Now I also got these because these have a more straighter leg than those ones that I just showed you from the thrift store. These are a little big in the waist, but I mean, like a smidge big in the waist. So I'm not gonna have these tailored because it's not really gonna be worth it because I can fix the um, excess that's in the back with you know a belt instead of just having them taken all the way in. They are a high rise. They still had the um, original tag on it. Whoever, whoever consigned these, didn't never, they never wore them. It still had the original sticker from purchase on it. And because these are tall, these also are high heel friendly. So bought these for $7.50. They were marked $14.99. Blue is half off. So I will do my DIY project on those as well. But another pair of jeans I got from Upscale Cheapskate. The last item I got from Upscale Cheapskate are these camo pants. And this is from Fashion Nova. Still had the original tag, so who um, ever bought these did not wear them. They are a size 1X. These are a little big in the waist, um, you know, probably about that much, but I think I can, I think I can adjust it, you know, right here. But overall, they do fit very, very well. And I had been looking for a camo pair, camo pants for um, a while, and just had not been successful in finding any. These were $15.99. I paid for these pants. All right, so that is all you guys that I got from the thrift store today. If you haven't already, be sure to give this video a big thumbs up. Drop down in the comments and let me know what was your favorite item out of the haul today. Let me know what was your least favorite item. You know, I am not sensitive, girl. Tell me what you don't like. I'm, 
I'm here for. Be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe, you guys. And I'll see you the next time. Bye. Thank you.